Hello you all, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cacti. Today we are with another part of I'm Not My Parents Challenge. So y'all, things might look a little different right now. The bed looks different, the walls look different, the floors look different. Everything is probably looking a little different right now. And let me tell you all the reason why for that. I have went on ahead and if you haven't seen already, but I built them a brand new house on the same lot of course, but a brand new house. Um, and yeah, they actually have a lot of money left over which I'm really surprised about, but Either way, we have a whole new house, um, whole new layout and everything. I'm so excited for you all to like get an official tour. I didn't really do a, a really, I didn't do a tour at all after I was done with the house, but um, in today's video we will. But not only that will be happening in today's video, but we will also be having our baby shower, and we might even go into labor during today's video. So we have a lot planned, a lot to do. So let's get right on into today's video. Okay, y'all, right here is the house. It doesn't look the best right now. It looks a little, like, greeny slash bluish, but it's really early in the morning, so I guess that's why it looks like this. But, um, yeah, so this is the outside of the house. I try my very best to, like, make it, make it still kind of cottagey vibes, but, you know, a house fit for a family um, and things like that. We still have our selling table out here, as y'all can see. We have a little bike and things. Um, and, yeah, when you go inside... You're hit with this, like, the house is very green-based, very green-themed. So you might see a, a little too much green in here, but <laughs> it's okay. So over here, you turn to your, this side, over this side, is the right? I don't know. You have a little kitchen area, where, not kitchen, a little dining area where you can sit over here and eat your food. And you come over here, a little family portrait. Where did her belly go? She better still be pregnant or I'll be really pissed off. But you have a little um, a little area where you can put your keys down and stuff. Take a tissue, look at the family portrait, all that nice things. Then right here is a little, is a little um, what's it called, hide chick. You know, they're, they're going to have a baby boy soon. So there's a little baby area. It's here for Paco to eat. Here goes the kitchen. The kitchen is quite small, but they don't do too much cooking, cooking in here. But even if they do, they do a lot of cooking, uh, I feel like this kitchen is good enough, you know? Because their main focus is really outside, outdoors. And yeah, this kitchen's so cute. I love it. And then when you go over here, oh, it's so beautiful in here. <laughs> Sorry, y'all. I'm just getting a little excited. It's so beautiful in here. I didn't, I, this is beautiful. Whoa, wow. Look at this, everybody. Whoa. So I'm actually amazed with this. Like the lighting coming through. Okay, graphics. And here is all of her flowers. Um, and when we get new ones, we'll put them over here. But yes, it's so beautiful. Like, look at this door right here. Oh, I love it. <laughs> when you come over here, is the little... Oh, I should go this way. When you come over here, is the little um, living room. Everything's pretty small and squished. I want I wanted it to be kind of like very um, a small, but a big home. So like, everything feels very like close-knit. And so over here... Sorry, y'all. But... Um, Okay, so right here we have, I really don't know what the last thing I said because my boyfriend called in the middle of me doing the recording, so I apologize. <laughs> but right here we have the little living room. It's quite small and cute. Have a TV here. Uh, I tried using some cottage living items, but not a lot But because we used, we used a majority of the cottage living items in the first house. So yeah, I have a little remote right there, a little candle there, a little couch and things. And there goes Paco being all cute and sweet. Unfortunately, he does not have a doggy bed, but I thought it was okay because we have this big old couch for him. And yeah, but if we have more room, we'll get we'll end up getting another um getting a bed for him. But you're probably like, why are there so many gnomes around? It is harvest fest today, so don't worry about that. Oh, I need, I need to paint that wall. But yeah, don't worry about that. You have a little bookshelf over here, and then when you come over here is the master bedroom. And so here we why does it look like that? That's so weird. I don't know why that's like that actually. But when you come over here, you see Esteban and Nia. Ah! But <laughs> I'm so excited, y'all. So here's the bedroom. All right, here's her dresser with some pictures pictures of them, the painting she got from their first date. Um, there's so many cute items are here. Uh, the mirror. Some little posties. Um, here goes the little end table with the pictures of them together once again. A clock. Over here is Nia's side. Her little box her grandma gave her. And um, picture of her grandma and her. And things like that. There's another one right there too, y'all. Here goes them in the bed. Cuddling and stuff. So cute. 
And then right here is the baby's nursery area. Oh my gosh. It's so cute. It is so cute. So here's a little nursery item right there. So cute little bassinet. Here's a little painting. And then whenever we get like the little handprint and his birth certificate, we're going to put it on the wall as well. But yeah, it's so cute in here. I love it. And then when we go over here is their bathroom. More greenish type type of themes going on in here too. If you don't hear my dog, I'm so sorry. <laughs> and then over here, I didn't do much to the um oh yeah, here's our our medals and stuff from our um competitions. But I did not do much when it comes to the upstairs area because we aren't really gonna be up here other than for right here, which is which is our laundry area. It's supposed to be like a bluey type of theme over here, but it's not giving blue right now. It's kind of giving like, like a like a sage green maybe. But here's goes the washer and dryer. We're no longer doing it outside, so upgrade. <laughs> but yeah. But yeah, that's the whole upstairs area. Wait, wait. No, over here, I didn't finish painting over here because I haven't like gone over here. But this will be the children's bedroom. I am hoping still that they'll be able to have one more baby after this. If not, we might go either surrogate or or maybe um, uh, what's it called? Adoption or IVF? One of those things. Those are options. And then we go out here is the backyard. Oh, I love it. So right here is her garden. So cute. And over here is the are the animals. Like, look at this. So nice. I am in love. They have a little girl right there too. But yeah, this is the whole house. I think it is amazing. I won't say amazing, but I think it's really beautiful. I love it a lot. And yeah, this is the home. Hope you all like this little tour. Okay, you guys, so right now it's 6.03 in the morning. I'm thinking about making them up right now. I want to have this um, baby shower slash harvest fest around maybe 1 or 2. We have so much to take care of with our farm and things, so we have to probably make them up now. So I'm going to have her sleep in a little bit, but I'll wake him up now. He's, he's pretty good. He's pretty good. So we're going to wake him up. He's going to go into his brand new bathroom, brush his teeth and things. And you know what? I have no radio in this house. And they love to listen to their music. So I'm going to have to grab a radio and put it right there. Yeah. He likes to go on jogs in the morning too. So I'm, I'm, I'm going to start trying to have him go on like a little run in every morning too. So I'm going to have him start that now. Let's go ahead and go for Energized Jog. I might even like try to order some earbuds for him. Oh, he already has some. Perfect. But yeah, he'll listen to some music and things so if he goes on his run. I love this house. I love how it gets so green coated. Oh, can I set this in the front door? Oh, it's already set. Oh, this is probably blocking the way, huh? Um, let's put these gnomes outside. Outside our door. Oh, I didn't, I didn't know it was like a little waterfall. That's so cute. Oh, and the wind chime. Wow, that's beautiful. I love this. Okay, so he's going on his jog this morning. I'm going to have it speed up a little bit while he's doing that. Um, Let's see what else we can do. She's getting ready to like have to pee and things. So we're going to go ahead and use the bathroom and wash her hands and brush her teeth. And then we're going to go on ahead and take a little shower. Let's wake up, Mama. Up she goes. Look how pregnant her belly is. Guys, look at her little belly. Not little anymore. Look at her belly. It's so huge. Guys. Ah, Nia is so cute. I love her. <laughs> um, Here goes a little alien in our bed. What the heck? What's he doing in our bed? Weirdo. Perfect. There we go. That's cute. So she's going to do that. I'm definitely, I can see her being hungry this morning. So we're going to definitely make some breakfast. Or do we have leftovers? Oh, grand breakfast? Hmm. Can we make a grand breakfast? Oh, we can. Okay, do a grand breakfast. Thank you, Nia. Is he done running for the day? He is done running. Perfect. Okay, she, has she gotten in the shower yet? She has not. Let's go ahead and have him fill. He wants to chat with Nia. She's about to get in the shower, dude. Let her let her go shower and things. Talk to her. Is he going to talk to her while she's showering? Okay, that's what I said. That's going to be too cute. Let's go ahead and fill this bowl. And then let's go ahead and have him take care of the animals. And it's a sign. 
Oh, wait. The chickens. <laughs> They're in our inventory. Oh, I'm going to sell the rest of these plants right here. I don't know if it's a good idea, but we are selling them, so... I'm, I might keep the birds of paradise just because they are worth so much. Hmm. Or should I not do that? I could put the plants right around here. Um. Don't know yet. Oh, we have this right here. Let's put this maybe in the back. A little bunny bird right there. Okay. Um. Let's put these chickens down. One chicken, two chicken, three chicken, four chicken, <laughs> and five chicken. Cute. Cute, cute, cute. Then let's have him assign all of these chickens to the coop. And then we're going to go on ahead and scatter some food around too. Cute. I love this. Okay. You're loud. She had on her little baker's outfit. On her flower arrangement outfit to make the little breakfast for us this morning. Cute. Okay. Can we call the... Why is he not... Why is Marshmallow not out? Is Marshmallow, is Marshmallow coming out? Hmm. I'm a little. I'm a. I'm a. I'm a little confused. Marshmallow is not. Hopefully, he comes out. She comes out later. We'll find out. Cute. Doofka. Mm -hmm. ah. I wanted to have a fireplace right here. I might be able to still have one. Huzzah! Or is that risky? I'll leave it be. Let's go ahead and play with Paco. Give you some pets. And some leavens. Give you a brush too. Oh, nice. I love hearing the wind chimes. That's beautiful. I think I can see them as being like a household who would not have shoes on. As well. I like know always wear like no shoes around the house. <laughs> Let me make sure I put that down so I can like assign that. Look at them. This is so cute. She's over there cooking. Her boys are over here playing. And she has one boy on the way. Okay, nice. We have breakfast already here. Um, should we go to this now? I kind of want her to eat later. But I feel like for sure we're going to come over here and give him a big old hug. And like thank him. Oh, yeah, be thankful, like, happy that he came to our life. Because if he wasn't here, we definitely would not be, be able to afford this house at all. Like, we are so thankful for him. <laughs> and let's tell him that, you know, come over here and, oh, what the heck? <laughs> Excuse me? Give him a hug. Bang. And then let's have him say hi to the baby. And we're like, baby saying thank you to you. Okay, I hate when that happens. Like, what is that? Okay, y'all. Can you chat together? Okay. Okay. Like, boy, what is that? <laughs> He's laid out. Oh, oh, Sims. Okay. <laughs> Anyways, let's go over here and tend to her garden. I'm gonna have him go ahead and use the bathroom and take a shower as well. And then I don't know where she's gonna give birth to the baby at, like at all. Make sure we talk to Paco too. Give him some special smooches and give him a hug. All right, that will do. And then we'll come out here and tend to the garden as well. I think I should go ahead and 
I'm going to harvest this pumpkin. And then I want to like sell everything else. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, look at the buddy. I love this. What, wait, what did she just do outside, dude? Not all the chickens sleeping right now. Why are y'all sleeping? It's a little odd. Showering. Nice, nice, nice. I think he'll probably, like, text his, his mom and let her know that... No, he bought a house. No, send a little text to her. And send a happy text to our best friend. Let, let, let them know a little bit. But can I get over there? Oh, she is not feeling the best. Oh, I hate how this goes away so quickly. I feel like it's like not going away at the amount of time it's supposed to go away at. She's having a complication, but I can't even have her take her medicine. Okay, never mind. Take your medicine, girl. Sell all of these. I got you, mama. Let's go over here and harvest this crop as well. Is she, why does she have so much like uncomfortable buffs going on right now? Let's have him take a few naps too, because he is a bit tired. Okay, then I want her to um, sell everything else. And then she has to pee. And then I guess we could probably have a, even an early start to our Harvest Fest. Plus baby shower. Which I love the idea of that. Let's do a future cube. Then when he wakes up, we'll do... We will... Because is she in her third trimester? Like soon to give birth trimester type of thing? Yeah. And then where's the other gnomes? Where do they go, actually? Throw that away for sure. Where are the other gnomes at? What the heck? They're supposed to be... Oh, wait, there's one over here. And then we'll give this one... Coffee. Nice, nice, nice. Nice, nice, nice. Okay, so... The gnomes ended up moving, but they're going back after them. Let's see. Was it a, okay? It was good. Okay, nice. How about him? Oh, why are you cheering, dude? He did not like your gift. We had to put him, let's plead for forgiveness, maybe. She's getting a little tired. Oh, and they gave us seed packets. This is perfect. I have to take a little nap. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. Um. Okay, let's go ahead and just put him in there. Let's sell him. Let's go ahead and sell him. So what the heck was that? They're going to take a nap, and then we're going to go ahead and start the party. I'm so excited for them. A nice little baby shower. I wonder what we'll get. Ah, all the nice things. But for now, they nap together. Oh, I love them. They're so cute. Okay, guys, I got this, like, new mod where you can, like, have a phone right here and, like, do stuff. So, I kind of want to see what I can do with it. Find a job. Okay, I can buy stuff. can order deliveries, hire services, travel. Can I do a party? <gasps> even plan an event. Perfect. Let's go ahead and do that. I'm going to see this actor interaction. I don't play it, really. Okay, you just go up to it. Okay, that's fine. Okay, baby shower, of course, and let's go to the expecting parents, which are Esteban and Mia, and let's also invite our guests. So we're going to invite Agatha, Alex, Emily, I would do the mayor, but the mayor and our boyfriend do not get along, so let's not do that one. Um, I think I'm going to say that his parents, like, flew in, him and his parents and his friend flew in to come, like, see the baby shower. So I'm going to just let them come along to you and his wife. Um, oh, Raul for sure. I was thinking maybe Quincy and Tucker, but I don't really feel like inviting them. 
So is this everybody who we're going to invite? There's nine people. The house isn't that big anyway. It's not that spacious. So yeah, we'll just do that. Perfect. And we're doing it now. Let's see the outfits. Oh my gosh, look at her outfit, y'all. Y'all look at her outfit. Y'all look at her outfit. Hey, you guys. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Oh, we gotta shave her legs. Let's go shave her legs real quick, girl. Let's go shave them legs real quick. A quick little shave. Don't worry, baby. Thank you. Estevan, stop. I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm go here and turn on some romance. Okay, we can turn on some little romance music. If you want a little flirty mood, okay. <laughs> Turn on some romance. Nice. Okay. Nice, nice, nice. I don't know why people keep on coming from this door when this is the front door instead, but it's whatever. Let's give our friend a hug, you know? Like, thank you for coming over. I, I know it was definitely quick for you to have to fly out here to come see my baby. Or to come see my baby shower with my what my girlfriend. I said why. Let's go ahead and tell them some funny stories. Okay. What she wants to do? Go ahead and have a chat. She goes, oh hey, I remember you. Go ahead and be like, thank you for coming. Where is it? Thank you for coming. Oh, they go to his dad too. So let's go and definitely and like. Say hello to him as well. Nice, nice, nice. Exchange your names and things. I have him go talk to his dad as well. Brian is day. Um, guess about the new baby who is here to come. And thank you for coming during um, Winterfest too. Oh yeah, his mom is also pregnant. I forgot all about that. I cannot believe that. I forgot. <laughs> like, girl, why are you pregnant? Uh, it's not about you. At all. Let's go ahead and also um, talk to him about the baby and things. How we're so excited for the baby to come. It's about the new baby. It's so much funny story about how him, her, and Esteban met, too. That could be cute. Oh, and let's go say hi to Alma oh, for her name. What's your name again? Asami. Say hi to Asami. Oops. Look at everyone getting all these sentiments together. Oh, I guess we can't do anything. It's fine. Is everyone who came? Oh, it's so cute. It's so mama funny story. Him and his dad aren't that close, so we're gonna do it with him. Well, one more idea, I would be so proud. Aw, so you a funny story. She's getting she's getting hungry and hungrier, so I'm gonna have her use the bathroom, and then whenever she gets back, we're gonna go on ahead and call for the meal. Do we invite Agatha? I cannot remember at all. Do we invite her? I'm gonna have her make a group with her friends. Why is she so uncomfortable? Oh, arthritis and she's craving healthy food right now. Auctions, form group. Agatha, you, you, you. I'm bringing all her friends. Yeah. That's all we'll have in our group. Let's kind of have them all go here together. Oh, perfect. There goes our girl, Emily. Hey, girl. I'm so happy you were able to make it. Thank you for coming. I love that. Grab drinks. That's probably not going to happen. Yeah, my girl said, I am hungry. I'm. Why is she in this outfit? I am pregnant and I am hungry right now. Let's go ahead and shake her off for her. Uh, this one? Yeah, perfect. Girl, in a better mood now, she's in this other outfit. Oh, we can ask you for the crepe item. I don't want to do that right now because we have our own food. Okay, people are getting hungry. Let's have her quickly. Oh, why is it happening? Let's call to the grand meal. Don't go in our fridge. Oh my gosh, she went in our fridge. Come on, you all. It is time to eat. 
<laughs> nice. I can't believe her mom is pregnant as well. Like, why would you do that? Is lactose in this? Dang. Well, oh, yeah. she's happy about it, so it's fine. You haven't gotten any gifts yet, though. I want them to become best of friends, so let's try and like continue talking to her a little bit. Do we know everything about Emily? We don't, so let's go ahead and chat with her a little bit more. Get to know you a little bit. Told you about some engineers. This is my nice unknown caller. Hang up. Do you canoe? No. Tempered heart to heart. And there was Alex. <gasps> Alex is pregnant too? Oh my gosh. But she is, her last name is still Hoots. We have to go talk to her right now. Deep conversation. Call her over. Right in her day. Alex, you're pregnant? That's so beautiful to me, y'all. There's some gossiping. Like, where, what happened? How, how much your pregnancy for real? Um, who is he talking to? Like, what? Alex is pregnant? Did you just go sit down? Like, girl, no. Where's she at? I am in shock. I am in shock. Oh, it is Raul, too? We gotta talk to him. Let's go over and be like, you want it for my baby? You want it for my tummy? Oh, uh, what's this? Make future plans on. Oh, you know what? I don't have that little, um, what was I say? Nice of you to ask. I'm my first trimester. I'm okay with having a child. Pregnancy has its good days and bad days, but it's overall an amazing experience. I love to hear that for you, girl. But dang, everyone's pregnant right now. And so maybe her baby and our baby could be friends. Oh my gosh. I love that idea. I so, so love that idea. Okay, nice. Let's go ahead and put up decorations. That's more like it. Yes, ma'am. And since we have bills, we do we really have bills. I don't think we do. Her caterpillar belly. I need to give her a new outfit because I don't think she'll be wearing this as an adult anymore. Makes me a little more, bit more calmer. Okay, I love this. Can we ask if our mom's baby? Because, like, girl, why are you pregnant? Why are you pregnant? <laughs> Why is she flirty? Okay, Paco. Cute. I don't know if she's pregnant. She like I'm not pregnant. I don't know if she's like single. Look at him. I feel his mama's freaking belly. Like yeah, son, I'm pregnant. You ask her like, you know, like what are you having? What does the baby do? Like what is up? <laughs> okay, nice. I really want to fill Alex's baby next. Good, become, he's becoming really good friends with his mom. I love that. And there, she's okay with being pregnant as well. Oh, I forgot all about freaking um, for her name, Brene. Let's talk to her too. Like, thank you for coming. Suggestive look. Not Alex trying to give our man a suggestive look? Are you kidding me, Alex? What's wrong with you? Are... Wow. I knew something was up whenever they kept on talking at the store. Good thing he's not like trying to like get with her or anything because that's like crazy. He thinks. Oh, he thinks she's very attractive though. Oh shoot. He has good compatibility with her too. Dang. Okay. I'm I'm so shocked by that. What the heck? I'm shocked and I'm hurt by that. Actually, is the real wording for that. Let's stop talking and let's eat our food. Set this sink as kitchen. The last bite. Please say it was. Because eight ten already. 
And she's, don't talk to her no more. We're done talking to her for the day. Cause that was so, that was so wrong of her. Can you please hurry up? Can you stop trying to talk to her? This is about dog snow. Eat your food. And now she has to pee. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Go, 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 go. She didn't even get to finish her meal. I, I do want Esteban to um, ask his parents how do they feel about um, about Mia, though. That is something I do want to do. Let's go over here and go to friendly gossip. Um, can we not? Oh, is, it, is it in a relationship now or something? Yeah, there's things we gotta ask about. Let's ask about Mia to dad and to mom. Mama, no, you cannot go to sleep. Stop it. Finish eating your food. I have them start cleaning up too. Let's see what they said. Mia is so is is one cool sim. I like her. Okay, Dad likes her. I don't think Mom has a comment. Has a comment. Here goes Mom. Okay, Mia's. She can they both like her. That's nice. I'm glad to hear. Okay, she finally finished her food. Freaking finally. I'm gonna go over here. Because Esteban has something planned. Something planned. So he's going to go over here too. And he's going to describe a new idea to her. No. Just, just stay standing there. Are we getting a baby shower gift? Oh, she's going to labor, y'all. Oh my gosh. During the baby shower. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, and definitely he's panicking now. He's like, oh shoot, did your water just break? <laughs> yeah, he's definitely panicking. Oh my gosh, this is getting a bit crazy right now. But, um, they're talking right now. He's like, I know you're in labor. I know you are in a lot of pain right now. I am so sorry to hear that about, about what's going on for you, baby. But I do have something I want to tell you. It's something that I want to do for you. And so I want to declare and express how fond I am of you. I've got a baby shower gift, finally. Got our first gift, bro. And then he's going to go over here and declare how much he loves her publicly. Come on. Why is she sitting down to talk? Oh my gosh, she's so annoying. He's gonna give her a kiss. And he's gonna tell her how fond he is of her and how thankful he is of for her. Oops, she said, "Oh, please don't sing." I am right now is not the time to be singing, baby. Those are romantic feelings. And lastly, but surely, we are going to go to relationships, and we are going to. Where's the option? <laughs> it's she's, is it because she's in labor right now? And that's why we can't do it? Oh, wait. <laughs> Pause. Okay, you all, I fixed it. So now we are going to propose. Okay, what are you talking about? How do you learn about that? What the heck? Anyways. Okay, you guys, it is happening. He is proposing to her. Like, what? She's like, oh my gosh, yes! <laughs> and we are now engaged. Esteban and Nia are... In oh, shoot. Ma'am, you are pregnant and in labor. I know you doing all this jumping is a good idea. He's like, whoa, now. <laughs> He's just like, whoa. <laughs> but yes, she is pregnant and engaged now. I'm so, so excited for them. Let's go ahead and can and cancel the baby shower now. And they are deeply in love. And let's go ahead and start this home birth. 
Yo, look, it says, is this really happening? Ah, of course, of course. We will marry their partner. She's been waiting for this moment for a long time. Oh my gosh, that's so cute. And she's engaged, needs engaged to be to be wed. Great news, but then again, it's a lot of commitment when she was so used to being single. Girl, please, you've been waiting for this. You wish you said it right there. And what's that? Had a milestone. Cool. How does he feel about the, the engagement? It's meant to be. As Ron can feel it deep down that they are re ready for the next step in their relationship. They can't wait to see the look on their partner's face once they put the pull out the ring. He's so happy. I love this for them. But you all, I said I was going to have the birth right now. But I think instead I will save it for the next video. So I hope you all enjoyed today's video. Um, I don't know if y'all expected, expected the proposal. But if you did, it was here. If you didn't, I'm glad to give you a little surprise. But yeah, in the next video we will be having the labor of our baby boy. I'm so, so, so excited. With no further ado, let's go ahead and end this part. Moon watch, take care. Bye.